My name's Kulududa. I'm here today with another video. I hope you enjoy. Okay, guys. This is Kulududa, if you can't tell. And I hope you guys enjoyed that really awesome intro. I actually haven't recorded it yet, believe it or not. <laughs> Honest, right? Honest, I'm valiant. And other accessories of life. I'm actually, this is going to be my first, oh, I'm so sorry about that, my first edited video. This is awesome, right? Light Seekers? Is it, I, I got the idea while watching a Light Seekers video that I should try editing a video and see how it turns out. That's what this is. So, I thought, well, that's a story for later at Stay tuned for the end of the video for that story. <laughs> okay. Light Seekers was at Toy Fair. Yeah, they were at Toy Fair. Skylanders was not there. But Light Seekers was. Uh, and also, uh, there's one last thing. I will be doing a video over what Nerf showed at Toy Fair as well because I haven't done a video about them in a while and I need to. <laughs> Back to Lightseekers. That was just like some announcement I needed to make. Back to Lightseekers. Yeah, uh, they showed off some new stuff at Toy Fair. They showed off a bit more in-depth gameplay than they ever have before. Can't show you any of it because it's not. I wasn't there to record the gameplay. I am so sorry. Excuse me for that. I wasn't there to record the gameplay for you guys, so I can't show it. At least I don't want to get a copyright strike. I'm trying to keep this channel clean. That's working out very well so far. Okay, uh, yeah, after what they showed, like, this was days ago, they showed the image that you will see, right? See, when you look at that image, as you can tell, you have the starter packs for the Marty and the Tyrax on the ends. And then you have I, uh, the I believe the flight packs and then the weapon packs. Those are what the packaging is going to look like. Uh, and in case you're wondering why I have my hand right here, it's because the video editor I use doesn't allow me to edit in a photo on screen. I have to put it in between frames of two different videos. That's what I'm just going to do. And now, as you can tell, the starter packs look A, awesome. You can tell they have two weapons and one character and a charger. Mm -hmm. My phone buzzed. I don't know why. <laughs> Hopefully not for anything I need to know, because I won't be checking it for a few minutes. Okay, back to that. Uh, yeah, those packs look awesome. And we also have information about their retailers. Their retailers are going to be, for launch, Toys R Us only. At launch, is what they said. They may go to other distributors further into the game lifespan. Yeah, it'll probably be a month or so. You never know. Okay, I need to stand in front of that light. I'm doing this at night, and I've never done this at this time of night in this position. Let's go. Let's do this. Old position. Yeah. That's how far I am from the recording area now. Okay, now that you can see my face, my beautiful face. Technical difficulties. Okay. We got pricing on the starter pack as well for $70, which we probably already knew. Coming with two weapons, charger, character, I already told you about this. And also, there were two Light Seekers jet pack, or flight packs, shown in toy form, but I couldn't find an image of their toy forms. Yeah. That's how awesome my internet skills are. But I did find an image of their animated form, which Light Seekers put on their social media. Like, I'm giving them credit. This is their images, basically. Like, 
The image is a something there. So that's what I'm trying to say. Something they own. Like the image, full, full credit to them. I think, please don't copyright my video. Here's the image now. Uh, now that you've looked at that image, we got to see the toy forms of those. And, uh, well, basically now we can go around and say, yeah, we now have seen two jetpacks. There was also some a back shot of the starter packs. I couldn't find it, so I can't put it in the video. That'd be a lot of editing work on me, too. And I, this is my first editing. I really think this is going to be a trial and error thing. But either way, um, what was I talking about? I had lack of attention, man. Give, give me time and I'll get over it. Oh, yeah, the back of the starter pack. It has device list on it, and that's one kind of device list I wasn't expecting. Like, I've seen mobile games device lists. They're not that big. Like, I don't have the Trap Team or the Superchargers mobile starter pack with me, but that wasn't near the size of that list, which means so many people are going to get to play this, and it's going to be so awesome. So, uh, kudos to you guys on that. that. That's awesome. And, uh, I just realized I have 10 minutes of space left on my phone. No, wait, 9 minutes of space left on my phone. That was a minute off. May want to delete some videos after I upload this one. And now, the most is on my Like I said, I have a the lack of concentration and it sucks. I was talking about. Oh yeah, the device list. And now that I've seen the sheer size of this device list, I'm I'm impressed with what they've been able to do. They're able to bring this mobile RPG to many devices. Ooh, uh, now that I've gotten over the awesome device list, let's go to release dates. Pre-orders for True or Toys R Us start on April the 15th. And they come out and the game comes out in July. I don't remember the date or if they said one. But either way it comes out in July. July. That's gonna make my summer awesome. They said uh, over a hundred hours of gameplay at launch. I mean I have a I have over a hundred hours of nothing to do. I have eight hours a day of nothing to do. Of course, I won't record. Whoa, I just realized how many. Let I want to do 30 minute Let's Plays for this game. How many Let's Plays is 200 Let's Plays just for what comes out on starting day? If I do 30 minute Let's Plays. Oh my goodness, that's, that's quite a bit of Let's Plays. Yes, I've got a summer of stuff to do. <laughs> Let's <play this. laughs> Not particularly awesome, but whatever. And so that's all basically all the information I have. Most of this video is ranking, and now the rest, and now, it's time to say, oh wait, I forgot, there's that story at the beginning of the video, like, you heard, like, the first part of it, okay, I started watching an edited Lightseekers video, and, I'm like, I, I realized the amount of editing this person was using, and I'm like, you know, I've always wondered how to do that. And I start searching around like my phone. This is how I edit everything. I start like searching around every little part of my phone. And then I finally end up in the gallery edit, download video editor, doing this with it now and it's gonna be awesome. 
I'm going to review these videos, upload these videos. This, this channel is changing for the better. I also have to record that intro, which, like I said in the beginning, I haven't recorded yet. I'm recording it when I'm done here. I've got my props that I'm going to use. And, uh, of course, you've already seen the intro, haven't you? Yeah, you've seen the intro. Why am I telling you this? I guess it's time for me to leave. Go record that intro that you've already seen by some time paradox of... I'm going to prison for this time paradox of... I don't want to go to time jail. Ah, <laughs> uh, this video turned more into a rant and uh, That was not my goal. I, I, I'm actually kind of sorry. I'm not kind of, like, very sorry. But either way, this is Cooler Duda signing out. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Yeah.